Alrighty, looks like we're live again. Hey there, everybody. It's the Nasty One here again, and welcome back to the next episode of the Saw Teeth franchise rebuild here in Super Mega Baseball 4. Year number three kicks off today here as we come off of two consecutive championships here in years one and two with a quest to making this team an official dynasty by winning our third straight here in year three. Looking at the team here after the off-season last episode, here's a refresher on who is new to the team and who we hung around with. Mackenzie Fry returning for her second year with us as our primary catcher. Behind her is now rookie catcher Colson Dozenrolls, who is a fielder. That That's about it. He doesn't even really do anything else well. He has utility. He can jump in the outfield for us or be backup catcher. Uh, but he's 19, he has the upside of being developable, so maybe that'll help him out and make him develop faster. Hang on to Peak Physique here as our primary first baseman. JYJ returns for our DH role in the, you know, bat against left-handers. Uh, second baseman Janice Freeman, after his renaissance year, returns to be our s uh, second baseman once again. Kieran Nutmeg returns for her third year at third base. John Ranero again is our primary shortstop for the third straight year. Goose Kabusta returns for his third season with us. Hanzo Majiko, another original member, sticks around as the utility guy off the bench. Rookie left fielder Holly Nicholson was signed to replace Howie Caldeed as she will take over in left field. Kathy Caldesac will split time with her against right-handers in left. She'll be the bench outfielder. Slash trips in center field. Of course, the man, the myth, the legend, the two-time reigning MVP. He is in center. Johnny Baggs, once again, in right field. He gets to keep his job. He's back for a third year. Returning from last year's playoff team, Ace Von Asen. He will be in his first full season with us, his third year in the league here. Uh, Cecil Sawyer, uh, he returns for his third season with us. He was our de facto ace in year two, performing uh, the best out of our starting pitchers. And then we have two rookies at the back end of the rotation, Carmen Midtown, the 19-year-old, and rookie 26-year-old Dom Turner. Moving to the bullpen, we hang on to Gertie Goatman, BH4, RH4, the Twins, Everett Waters, and Maximo Prima, our entire bullpen, returns for another crack at the title. Our season kicks off with a doubleheader here today against the Sirloins. Here's the pitching matchup for Game 1. Ace Von Asen on the mound versus Donk O, oh, the newly acquired ace of the Sirloins, as he leaves the Jacks organization to come over here and be the top end of the Sirloins rotation Sterlings are again still all power. They also invested mightily in their bullpen at the cost of their contact and their defense, which are almost non-existent. Their speed is above average, and so is their starting pitching. So let's see how this goes. Here's the lineup we'll use for game one of the season. Leading off in center will be Slash Trips. Peak Physique batting second at first base. John Ranero at shortstop. He'll bat third. Kenzie Fry will bat fourth behind the dish. Johnny Baggs gets the start at right field. <laughs> We'll be at number five, batting six, second baseman Janice Friedman, batting seventh, rookie left fielder Holly Nicholson, batting eighth, DHing today JYJ, and batting ninth is third baseman Kira Nutmeg. Let's get it on. Get ready to kick off year number three here at Apple Field as once again our first half of the season is primarily road games, seven to one ratio, and the back end will be seven home games to one road game. We'll go ahead and jump to the lineup for the Sirlings here in a second as we jump into the game. I'll do that when they come up to bat for the first time today, but I see a lot of familiar faces from last year's squad, so shouldn't be too many changes. Whoa, it's game time at Apple Field. Got a day game here to kick off the season. Let's get it on. This could be part of a day-night doubleheader. Trips, Physique, and Renero do up first against Donk O as he's ready to tow the rubber here. The lefty is set. Leading off for us is the two-time reigning MVP, Slash Trips. That ball hitter active here for Slash as he's ready to go. First pitch slider in there at the knees, 0-1. Oh, we're seeing low from O, ball one. Peter Wade laid on it, 1-2. Curve up and Wade line back at the middle base hit for Slash as he uses bad ball hitter to great effect. He's on with a leadoff knock to start the game. Next up, first baseman Peak Physique, turning for his third year with the team. Looking to bounce back after a horrible second season. We saw him just barely bat over 200. Slider way is outside, ball one. Heater up and away is high, 2-0. -oh. 
Change up and in hard. Ripper to third. Off the glove of the third baseman. She had no time to react. That is going to be an E5 as run to third. Fails to handle it. John Renero up next. 2 on, None down here in the first. As they do give the error to third. But she did not go tense, I believe. Oh, no, she did. Just didn't see it on the screen. John Renero with the RBI chance. 2 on, None down here. Change of middle. Instruct call to one as uh, O gets ahead. Fastball way late on the whiff outside, 0-2. Slider middle in, Renero pops it up, shallow left center. Racing in is the left fielder, he'll call it off. And Philly Jones puts it away, one down. Two on, one down, here's catcher Mackenzie Fry in the cleanup slot, second year backstop. Getting the start here against the lefty O. Heater in there at the knees, 0-1. Now, uh, Mackenzie Fry obviously is better against right-handers with the power trait boost. But uh, she is the de facto catcher now, as Colson does the rolls is a solid D plus compared to Mackenzie Fry's uh, B plus. <laughs> That's bumping in with late 0-2 the count. Curve ball away, pulled hard on the ground first, diving doozy shine to cut it off. He'll flip to the pitcher in time, two down. First, second, and third now a two down for Johnny Bags. Right fielder needs to drive in some runs here. Let's see if he can get it done. Change bump and away, strike call, no one. That heater's outside, 1-1. One, one. Slider middle of the plate, crushed by Bags to right center field. That's hit pretty well. Giving chase, though, is Ganez, and she'll run it down to end the inning. We strand two in scoring position. Bottom one, we cannot capitalize on the air. We're scoreless. JYS, run to third, and Doozy Shine, do up first here against Ace Von Ace, and his AVA takes the mound. JYS leading off, father of our backup first baseman, JYJ. Still kicking it here at age 45 here in the league. It's third year in the league, first with the Sirloins. Contact first lefty active here against Von Asen. Here's the lineup for the Sirloins today. Leading off after him, it is 10th third baseman round to third. He made the air in the first inning. Batting third, first baseman Boozle Doozy Shine. Stake it around for his third season. Batting fourth is D.H. Herbert Hackman. Batting fifth, left fielder Flay Jones, an original member of the Sirloin squad. Same with shortstop Willard Wiggins. He's batting sixth. Gabby Ganez comes over from the Nemesis. She's batting seventh in right field. Tish Ballin returns for her third year with the Sirloins in center. She's batting eighth. Batting ninth, former Platypie second baseman Kerry Cartman. Looking at the bench for the Sirloins, Momo Tobo returns for another year as the backup catcher. Man and Moon is brought over from the Wild Pigs. Mick Steele returns for his third year on the bench. And then moving to the pitching, they have Joffrey Rockman from the Moose. He will be starting game two of the series of this doubleheader. Uh, he's scheduled to anyway. Uh, they have a second-year pitcher, Ronald Pacheco. They have uh, Melody Moods, one of our former starters from the original team. Third-year long reliever, Split Seamerson, returns for another year with the Sirloins. Dura Neverwalker is picked up from the Heaters. Uh, Shay D returns for her third year. Miguel Duke returns for his third year. Linus Digby returns for his third year. And closer Klaus the game for the Moose is on the back end of the bullpen. Looks like they went really bullpen heavy here and gave up a bench slot here on uh, the offensive side of things. AVA, uh, he was great in the playoffs for us. Won the deciding game three for us as well So in the finals. So he got the chance to come back here this season and prove it wasn't a fluke. First year with the team fully as that's Clyder is down and in for a strike going one. AVA, of course, used to be the ace of the Platypi organization. Four seamer down and in is inside. Ball one. Change of away. Outside to JYS. 2 1. Curveball down and away. That's foul off. 2 2. K collector act for ABA here. Slider up and in. Inside. 3 2. Good take there. Force him down and in. Blew it by him. Strike three. First punch out for ABA. One down. Next up, third baseman run to third. He was tense after the air in the top half of the first. Force him down in the way. Strike call. Or one. Change up and in. Fouled back, 0-2. Okay, collector active. Slider down and in. Fouled off, still 0-2. Curveball down and away. Chased and fouled off late, 0-2. Or fouled off early, I should say. Change up and away. Runda pops at foul over the screen. We'll stay at 0-2. 
Force him up and in. Chased it high, strike three. Back to back K's for AV8 to open the day. Two down. Here's Boozle Doozy Shine, the third year first baseman. Playing a backup slot as he's normally a third baseman by trade. Now can play the entire infield. Good to see him developing a little bit here. Still a very fearsome hitter. Heater down and then strike call. 0 1. Curveball down. Check swing low. Good take. 1 1. Change buffet in is inside. 2 1. Slide up and away. Taken high. 3 1. Where's him down in the way? Line to first right at Physique, and that's a 1 2 3 inning for AVA as he's through the first. To the second, we're scoreless. Friedman, Nicholson, and JYJ do up. Janice Friedman leading off in the sixth slot today as the second baseman returns for his second year with us, original wide load member. Slider in there at the knees, 0 1. Curveball in there at the knees, 0 2 as two breaking balls meet it over. Heater up, chased at strike three. First punch out for O as he waves bye bye. One down, and here's rookie left fielder Holly Nicholson getting her first at bat here in the series. And the league in general. Changeup is up high, taken, ball one. Changeup down and in low, call to strike, 1 1. Heater away with late outside, 1 2. Curveball put away, dumped to left field, down for a base hit. Is that is the first career hit for Holly Nicholson? As she'll reach with one down in the second. Let's get that ball, boys. Give that to her for her trophy case. And that'll bring up JYJ, the DH today, with power versus lefty active here. Had a little conversation with his father before that at bat. Nice to see those two interacting again, of course. They were both teammates in year one. Slider hangs on the first pitch. He didn't take it. 0 1. Strike called. With late on the heater up in the way, 0 2. Curveball up and in, crushed by JYJ to left center field, but that is going to hang up for balling. Two down. Runner still at first here. Two down in the inning for the nine hitter. Up is Kira Nutmeg, the third baseman. Third year with the club here. Change it down the way outside to Kira, ball one. Slider up and in, strike called at the letters. Good pitch, 1 1. Slider up and in, dump to right center. That is going to get down for a base hit. Going for third, Nicholson. Here's the throw from Ballin. It is just in time to nail the rookie as she got over aggressive and Ballin made her pay. Bottom three, two, we're still scoreless. Hackman, Jones, and Wiggins do up. Here's Herbert Hackman, the DH today, former Moonstar's third baseman. He's DHing for the Sirlins now. Going to a division rival. Slider down and in the first pitch. Hard grounder to short. Past the diving Renero in the left center. That's a base hit. First hit today for the Sirloins is the knock by Hackman. He's on the lead off the second for left fielder Filet Jones, the power bat. Batting in the five slot today. Curveball down and in on the first pitch. Just inside to Jones. Ball one. Puts him down in the way. Check swinging just outside. 2-0. Change it down and in, check swing, strike, 2 1. Push him down in the way, chased it outside, 2 2. Okay, collector active, slider up and in, fouled off by Jones over the screen, 2 2. Dribble down and in, chased and fouled off, still 2 2. Or some ripping away, caught too much of the plate, crushed by Jones down the left field line, and that right field line, and that is not coming back. That is a nice tenderized piece of meat there for the sirloins as Filet Jones cracks open the scoring. Two run bomb as that makes it two nothing. First homer of the year. That'll get the scoring started with the bang, and here's Willard Wiggins, the shortstop, hitting, uh, hitting his first at bat of the year. Forcing him up and away in the first pitch. Fouled off over the screen. 0 1. Change it down and in. Whiffed out in front of it is Wiggins. 0 2. He was looking fastball. Slider down the way just low. 1 and 2. Rubble down in the way in the dirt. Chased it anyway. Strike 3. Fry picks it out of the dirt. Fires the first one down. Third punch out for AVA. That'll bring up right fielder Gabby Ganez with the durable trait, so reducing her chance of injury. Coming over from the Nemesis organization is Ganez, getting the start in right field today. We're seeing up and away is high, ball one. 
We're about down the way outside. 2-0. Was Humor up. Liner softly to second. Freeman races in. Picks it on a hop to first. Two down. Base is empty for Tishball and the center fielder hitting in the eighth slot today for the Sirloins. Third year with the organization. The she's an original member. Curve ball down. Hard grounder to third on the first pitch. Nutmeg fields it cleanly to first. And that's going to end the inning. But a two-run bomb for Filet Jones gets the Sirloins on the board. 2-0 to the third. Trips Physique and Renero do up against Tonk. Oh. Tried to get that fastball up and away on Jones, and it caught too much of the plate. Ended up being middle away center cut, and Jones just unloaded on it. Trips leading off with rally starter and bad ball hitter. He's one for one today with a single already. O sets, fires, first pitch curveball low, misses, ball one. Change buffet in high and inside, 2 0. Slider at the knees, fouled off late by Trips out of play, 2 1. Pass it down and then whiff late, 2 2. Change up it in, hard rip early on it, foul, still 2 2. Pass it down the way, dumped by trips down the right field line, that is down for a base hit. Second hit for Slash today, he's 2 for 2. Lead off man on here for Peak Physique, he's 0 for 1. Reached on an error his first time up by the third baseman, run to third on a hard hit grounder at her. Slider away, strike called on the corner, a 1. Peter up and away, hard chopper to first. Doozy shine to second one. Wiggins back to first, double play. That erases the threat. Two down, base is empty for John Ranero. He popped out his first time up to left center. 0 for 1 today. Force him down and away, low and outside. Ball one. Change it down and then rip foul out of play. 1 1. Change up and then rip down the line, but foul out in front of it is Ranero. 1 2. Either way, late strike three, second punch out for O, and that ends the inning. Key double play ends the threat. Bottom three were scoreless still. 2 nothing. Sirloin's lead. Cartman, JYS, and third. Do up. Here's Kerry Cartman, the second baseman, batting in the nine slot today for him, a platypi infielder. Just before Seamer up, taken high. Ball one. Force him down in the way. Cartman whiffs over it. 1-1. One one. Slider down and in just low. 2-1. Curve off and away. Cartman checks his swing. Called a strike anyway. 2-2. Two, two. Change up and in. Check swing. Strike three called. Fourth punch out for ABA. One down. JYS up next. Struck out swing in his first time up. He's over one today. about the knees on the first pitch strike called at one we're we'll down and then JYS takes it strike called oh two slider put in way inside almost hit him as he ducked back one two change it away chased and fouled off out in front still one two we're we'll seeing away check swing outside two two we're balling in JYS pokes it foul behind the plate still two two Slider middle in. Line to left center field into the gap. That is going to be a possibly extra basis for JYS as Trips runs it down. Plays it off the fence and gets it in quickly, but it is still a double for JYS. He's on with one down in scoring position. Here's run to third. 0 for 1 with the strikeout. Currently still tense. First him down and in on the first pitch. Low and inside. Ball one. First him down and in. That's fouled back into the screen. 1-1. One, one. Slider up and away. Outside. 2 1. Rubble down and away. Low. 3 1. Change up. Chased it high. Full count. Payoff pitch coming. Let's see down and away. Chased outside. Hitting the hole to second into right field, though. That's a base hit. Bags gets to it quickly. Gets it in. That'll hold JYS at third. Runners at the corners. One down for Doozy Shine. Lined out his first time up to first base. He's over one. Slider from away on the first pitch. Line to first. Physique lead and lunges out of his reach into right field. That'll be a base hit. One run scores. Runner digging for third. Throw is offline and cut. Runners at the corners. One down. Three nothing. Sirloins. First RBI of the year for Doozy Shine. Here's Hackman. One for one with a single and a run scored his first time up. 
Change of away on the first pitch. Outside, ball one, no call. Or him down and in, strike call, runner goes, throw down to second in time to nail the runner as Fry throws out her first runner of the year. Two down is, who was that that got caught? That was Doozy Shine. One one the count to Hackman, two down, runner at third. Throw ball down in the way, just in the dirt, two one. Or him roping in, taken high by Hackman, three one. Big hack active for him here. Change of middle in, inside ball four, first walk for AVA. Hackman reaches. Here's Jones, one for one with a two run homer today. We'll do it again here. Curve ball down and in, in the dirt. Almost hit him in the toe. Back off, ball one. Change up in the dirt, taken, 2 0. Lighter middle in, inside, 3 0. We're seeing her down and in. Strike call, 3 1. Change it down the way. Jones rips it to the gap right center field. He goes with it, and that's going to get another run home. It is going to be at least four to nothing. Second runner coming to third. Trips gets the cutoff man. Runner coming around third. Here's the throw from Friedman. No shot. It's a two-run double. Five nothing. Sirloins. Jones up to four RBIs on the day. Here's Wiggins. 0 for 1 with RBI hero now as ABA still tense. Four-seamer up and away is outside. Ball one. Slider down the way. Check swing strike. 1-1. One, one. Change it down and in. Inside low. 2-1. Curveball up and in. Fouled off. 2-2. Two, two. Slider up and in. Rip foul. Wiggins out in front. We'll do it again. Still to still 2-2 two, two count. Forcing the middle of the way. Popped up to left center field. Nicholson going over is there. She'll make the catch to end the inning, but... Three home in the inning as the Sirlins extend their lead to 5 nothing to the fourth. Fry, Bags, and Friedman do up against O. Here's Mackenzie Fry leading off, 0 for 1 today. Looking to get us back in it here offensively speaking. Forcing her high, taking ball one. That changeup's high and away, 2-0 the count from O. Changeup down and in, Fry waits for it, drives at the right center, but didn't get enough load on it. Ball and runs it down for the first out. Johnny, Johnny Bags up next. He's over one today. Blew out his first time up to right center. Peter down and then strike called. A one. That change ups away outside. One one. Peter outside. Two one. The count to Bags. Curveball down in the way. Dump foul. Late. Two two. Oh, looking for the out here. Pass but down and then grounded the second. Cartman makes the play. Two down. O locked in, base is empty for Friedman, he's over one. Struck out his first time up. Slider inside, struck called, 0-1. Change with the knees out in front of it, 0-2. Curve up middle end, bloop the left field as Friedman drop, drops that in in front of Jones, his first hit today. Runner reaches with two down as O down the neutral mojo. That keeps inning alive for rookie Holly Nicholson. Singled her first time up and then was to run out trying to get to third on a single. Force him away, strike called at the knees, 0-1. Fastball up late on the swing, 0-2. She chased it high as well. Change up and in, Nicholson skies it to right field. Easy play for Ganez as she's over a step to her right. Puts it away to end the inning. Nothing doing for the saw teeth in the fourth. Bottom fourth, still 5 to nothing. Ganez balling in the Cartman do up. Here's Gabby Ganez, 0-1 today. First pitch change up, up and in, taken high, ball one. Forcing the middle down at the knees, grounded hard to short, just past the diving glove of Renero. That's another base hit. Seventh hit today for the Sirlins as the leadoff woman on in the fourth. <laughs> That'll bring up Tish Ballin, who's over one today. Dribble down and in, almost hit her in the knees. She gets out of the way, though, ball one. Forcing down in the way, strike call, one one. Change up and away, way outside, 2-1. Ladder middle in, check swing strike, 2-2. Two, two. First team up and in, taking high, 3-2. Full count offering coming. Curveball way a high as if ABA lets that go too early. Second walk for him today, 2-1, none down for bottom of the lineup, Kerry Cartman, he's 0-1. 
And Cartman send it to the top with a run in. Let's see. Change it down the way in the first pitch. Taken low. Ball one. Receiver down. Strike call. 1-1. One, one. Slider down and in. Grounded to short. Renero in the hole. Backhands to third one. Nutmeg across the first. Late. Fielder's choice. Lead runner retired for JYS. He doubled last time up and scored later in the inning. He's one for two. Got a good RBI chance for the old man. Can the catcher get it done? Curveball up and in on the first pitch. Floats in there for a strike at the letters. 0-1. Four seamer away. Grounded in the hold of second. Freeman over on the dive. Just out of his reach. That's a base hit. Bags races in. Gets the throw into home. Here's the relay. It's close. Not in time. RBI knock for JYS. It's 6 0. Here's run to third. One for two with a single today. Slider down. In there at the knees. 0 1. Change of middle in. Ripped hard and foul. Out in front of it is third. 0 2. Four-seamer up and in. Loop to first, leaping physique out of his reach down the line. That's going to be another fair ball. And it gets under Bags' his glove. That's going to get two home. Nope, never mind. JYS holds the third. It's 7-0 on the double. AVA rattled. Here's Doozy Shine, one for two with an RBI single. That's going to do it for AVA today. Three in the third innings, nine hits, two walks, seven earned runs, five strikeouts, runners on base, his responsibility. Not a great day for the ace. We're going to go to the bullpen. Long reliever Gertie Goatman coming out. So we're down 7 to nothing here in the fourth. Asking a lot of Gertie here, but he's the only I hope I got here against Doozy Shine. Let's get it on. First pitch, curveball down and away. Grounder soft roller to third. Nutmeg races in, fires home, gets JYS in a rundown as he was getting aggressive. Nutmeg will tag him out here to be the second out of the inning. First and second after the fielder's choice, here's Herbert Hackman. Walk last time up, he's also singled. One for one today. Slider down and in, just low, ball one. Hackman's also scored twice today, fastball down, fouled late off the first base side, one one. Ball down below the knees, chop slow roll to short, Renero races in, bare hands to first. In time to end the inning as Goatman strands the inherited runners to get out of it, but AVA gives up two more and gets chased from the game after three and a third. Seven runs given up. It is seven nothing to the fifth. JYJ, Nutmeg, and Trips do up as we are looking for answers. Here's JYJ, 0 for 1 today. So that is first time up. Slider way is outside, ball one. Peter up and way chased it high out of the zone, 1 1. Fastball middle and blew it by him, 1 2. Heater up, chased by JYJ, but it puts it down the right field line. Fair ball into the corner that could be extra bases. Gets by Ganez as she misplays at the carom. Digging around second is JYJ. He's going for third. Relay throw from Kerry Cartman is late. It is a leadoff triple for JYJ here in the fifth. Here now Meg up next, one for one with a single. Oh, no longer locked in as he's starting to tire now. This will be his 60th pitch of the day. Slider down and in just low, ball one. Now we popped out her first time up. That slider's inside, 2-0. Curveball down, grounded to short. That'll get the run home. Wiggins to first. RBI ground up for Nutmeg. It is 7-1. Saw teeth on the board. Slash trips up next. He's 2-2 two two today with two singles. Looking to get it done here in his third at bat as well. Rally starter and bad ball hitter active. Change up caught the knees, 0-1. Fastball down the middle. Missed it, 0-2. Wasn't expecting it there. Curveball hangs. Line to left center, but it's right at Jones. Two down. Base is empty for Physique. Two down. He's over two. Grounded into a double play last time up. He's also reached on an error. Curveball down and in. Strike called. 0 1. Curveball at the knees. Physique cracks at the center, but he got under it. Back forward balling, and that ends the inning. One run in on the ground out by Nutmeg, though. 7 1 to the bottom of the fifth. Jones, Wiggins, and Ganez do up. Blay Jones leading off. Two run double last time up. He's also hit a two run homer. He's driven in four of the seven Sirloins runs today, facing Goatman. Got the last two outs last inning, coming out for his first full inning of work. Was him down in the way, strike call, 0-1. Slider put in, lined up the middle base hit. As Jones has his third hit today, he's now a triple shy of the cycle. And he's locked in. 
Lead off man on in the fifth for Willard Wiggins. He's 0 for 2. Slider middle in. Strike call, 0 1. Curveball down and in. Check swing low, 0 2. Four seamer away. Outside, 1 2. Four seamer up and away. Chased it. Strike three. First punch up for Goatman on the air. One down. Next up, Ganez, 1 for 2 with a single. Seam up and in. Strike call, 0 1. Curve ball away, outside, 1 and 1. Slide in middle of the plate, fouled off late by Ganez, 1 2. Seam in the middle of the plate, fouled off, 1 2. Curve ball down and away, checked in the dirt, 2 2. Slider in the dirt, taken low, 3 2. In the middle of the plate, line to right, bags in, makes the catch, two down. Jones still hanging on at first here with two down. After getting on base to lead off, here's Ball. I know for one with a walk last time up. Or Seamer up and away in the first pitch, strike call, 0 1. Slider down, taken low, 1 1. Or Seamer down in the way, just outside off the plate, 2 1. Her ball up and in. Strike called, 2 2. Ball and taken on the way is yet to offer out a pitch. Seamer up and away, taken high, 3 2. Full count, runner will be off with the pitch here. Slider down and away, chopped in the hole to third. Now make dives, knocks it down. That's going to be an infield single for Ball, and as Renero has no chance. Two on, two down for Cartman, 0 for 2 today. First pitch curveball middle in. That is hard grounded up the middle through the box. Base hit. Trips racing in. Gets to it. Jones hangs at third. Bases are loaded here with two down. Here's JYS who singled in a run last time up. He's also doubled today. Two for three. He's got the bases loaded. Looking to break it open here against the lefty. Or seamer up and in. Check swing to inside. Good take. Ball one. Curveball down. Taken low. 2-0. Four-seamer middle in, blew it by him, 2-1. Curveball middle in, grounded the third, right at nutmeg. She'll fire to first. That ends the inning as Goatman strands the bases loaded in the fifth. It's at a sixth, it's still 7-1. to one. Renero, Fry, and Bags do up. Renero leading off, 0-2 with a stri one strikeout today. He's also popped out. Struck out last time at the plate. Curveball in there at the knees, 0-1 from 0 Curveball again at the knees, 0-2. Fastball up and in, blew it by him, strike three. Another punch out for O, his third. Second for Renero. Here's Fry, 0 for 2. Fastball down in the way, whiff late, 0-1. Slider up and away, down the left field line. Fair ball over the diving third baseman. Run to third. Single for Fry, she's on with one down in the inning. That's then going to bring up Johnny Baggs, who's 0 for 2 today. Blown out and grounded out. Curveball hangs in the first pitch line to right center over the leaping Cartman's glove. That's a base hit. Two on, one down. Sawteeth have a shot here to get back in it with some runs. Make it a little more manageable. Here's Friedman, one for two with a single. That'll do it for Donk O, a surprisingly quick hook. But with the bullpen talent they have, I'm not surprised. Five and a third for O today. He comes two out shy of a quality start. Eight hits, earned run, three strikeouts, two runners on base, his responsibility. Shady coming out of the bullpen, the lefty with falls behind. The original Sirloins member, third year with the club. Trying to keep the inherited runners from scoring. Fastball away, strike call, caught the outside corner. Nice pitch, 0-1. Fastball middle in, kerned on by Friedman to left center, but that's going to hang up there for Jones. He'll run it down at the warning track. Two down. Two still on here for the Sawteeth. For the seven hitter, Holly Nicholson flew out last time up. She's also singled once, one for two today. Looking for her first career RBI. Change up taken low below the knees. Ball one. Lefty lefty matchup favors D here. Cutter misses inside. 2 0. Fastball down and then whiff late. 2 1. Change of play, pulled foul over the diving glove of Doozy Shine. Nice effort, 2-2. Two, two. 
Fastball down, hit up the line, foul on the third base side now, still 2-2. Two -two. Fastball down the way, whiffed on it, strike three. First punch out for Diaz, she strands the inherited runners, and we get nothing in the sixth course. Bottom six is still 7-1, third, Doozy Shine and Hackman do up. Here's run to third, two for three. RBI double last time up, she's also singled and is back to Nutramojo after the error in the first inning. Four seamer up, taken high, ball one. Slider pin away. Third drives it down the right field line, but that's way foul. A little late. Had the distance, though. 1-1. One, one. Four seamer down in the way. Outside and low. 2-1. Four ball down in the way. Chased it in the dirt. 2-2. Two, two. Slider pin in. Popped up. Just off the mound to his left is Goatman. Makes the play in front of first. One down. Here's Doozy Shine. One for three with an RBI single last time up. Forcing me down, strike call, 0-1. Curveball down in the way, outside, 1-1. One one. Doozy Shine's also been caught stealing once today. Slider down and in, strike called, 1-2. and Forcing me up and away, crushed by Doozy Shine to right field. He got that one, folks. That's not coming back. Second homer of the game for the Sirloins. First of the year for Doozy Shine. It is 8-1. Back to a seven-run lead. Here's Herbert Hackman, one for two with a single and a walk today. Curveball hangs on the first pitch, fouled off by Hackman, out of play, 0-1. Oh, Four seamer up and in, check swing inside, taken, 1-1 one, one the count. Slider down in the dirt, away, 2-1. Four seamer down and in, hit in the hole to second, Friedman over, cuts it off, fires to first, two down in the inning. Now to bring up Flay Jones, singled last time up. He is now a triple shy of the cycle. He also has a two-run double and a two-run homer today. He is locked in, feeling it. Force him down in the way, taking low, ball one. The ball hangs. Jones missed it, fouled off over the screen, one and one. Slider in, inside, two, one. Force him down and in. Chop slow roller to third. Nutmeg races in. Bear fields it cleanly to first. That ends the inning. Another homer for the Sirloins, though, as Doozy Shine connects with his first of the year. 8 1 now to the seventh. They're back to a seven run lead. We have nine outs left to use. JYJ, Nutmeg, and Trips do up here. Game one, not looking so hot for the Salty today. Here's JYJ, 1 for 2 with a triple. Triple to score to run last time up. Powers lefty still active for JYJ. Heater chased outside and fouled off late to 1. Fastball way chased outside, 0-2. Curveball popped it up in front of the mound, calling for it as the catcher. Making the play is JYS, one down as he retires his son. Next up is Nutmeg, 1-2 for two with an RBI single. RBI ground out last time up. She's also singled earlier. Curveball at the knees, line to third, leaping his run to the robber of a base hit. Two down for trips, base is empty. Lined out to left field last time up. He's 2-3 for three with two singles. D now locked in out of the bullpen, having a good time. Curveball away outside, ball one. Change of down and in, strike call, 1-1. One, one. Curveball up and away, line to right field, base hit for trips. His third hit today, he's three for four. Now to keep the inning alive with two down. Need to get something this inning, guys. Here's Physique, 0 for three. D no longer locked in. Four-seamer inside, strike call, 0-1. Heater up and away, chased outside, 0-2. Fastball away, hard grounder in the hole, past the diving second baseman, base hit. First hit for Physique on the ear. Two on, two down. Keeps getting alive for Ronero, who's 10, so for three today. Heater up, chased it high, 0-1. Fastball up, chased it high again, 0-2. Fastball up, hard grounder to first, right at Doozy Shine, and that ends the inning. To the bottom of the seventh, it's eight to one. Wiggins, Ganez, and Ball undo up. Gonna go ahead and make a defensive sub here. I'm taking Ranero out. We're gonna put in Hanzo Majiko as he'll play shortstop as the defensive sub here. We're also gonna take out Goatman, who goes uh, mm, two and two thirds innings in relief, giving up four hits, one earned run on a homer, and striking out one batter. Gonna go to the bullpen and bring in second year reliever Everett Waters, as this is not a high pressure situation at all. 
Gets ahead active for the sophomore pitcher facing Wiggins, who's over three today and tens. <coughs> Four seamer taken outside, ball one. Change it down and in, inside, 2 0. Throw ball down, strike called, 2 1. Four seamer middle in. Pulled foul by Wiggins, out of play, 2 2. Cut her up and away. High and outside, 3 2. Change of middle away, hangs in the middle of the plate, fouled off. Wiggins missed it, full count. Good ball down and in. Chased it, strike three. First punch out of the year for Waters, one down. Ganez up next, one for three with a single. Cutter down and in on the first pitch, check swing strike called, 0 1. Four seamer up and in. Ganez skies it right center, trips racing over. Runs it down in the gap for the second out. Base empty for Ballin. Single last time up. She's one for two. And uh, drew a walk. She is now stimulated, which makes her juiced. Good for her, I guess. First pitch curveball, middle away. Hangs. Checked it. Swing. Strike called. 0 1. Four seamer down and in. Strike called. 0 2. Change up and in. Chased it. Strike three. Second punch up for Waters. 1 2 3. Seventh inning for him. To the eighth, it's eight to one. Fry, Bags, and Friedman do up. Here's Fry, one for three with a single, trying to get it started against Fry. Or D. Cutter up, strike call, 0 1. Cutter down in the way, lined over short, running it down Wiggins, one out. Johnny Bags is up next, one for three with a single, last time up. Cutter away, strike call, 0 1. Nice pitch there from D. Fastball away, laid on it outside, 0-2. Fastball up, chased it, strike three. Second punch out for D, two down. Base is empty for Friedman, one for three with a single. D locked in again. Fastball down and in, chased it low, 0-1. Fastball away, Friedman goes with it down the right field line. That's going to stay in play. Ginez there, puts it away, 1-2-3 inning in the eighth. Bottom eight, it's still 8-1. Cartman, JYS in third, do up. Here's Cartman, one for three with a single today, facing Waters. 11, Change away in the first pitch, strike call, 0 1. Four seamer middle in, check swing misses inside, 1 1. Curve ball inside, missed, 2 1. Change it down the way, Cartman grounds at the second, Freeman to his right, backhands, fires, 1 down. Waters locked in out of the pen. Here's JYS, 2-4 with a double and an RBI single earlier. He's also struck out once today. Contact for his left, he's still active. Four-seamer high, ball one. Curveball down and in. Fouled off by JYS, 1-1. One, one. Change it down the way. Pulled down the left field line into the corner. That is a foul ball as Nicholson gives chase, 1-2. Cutter up and in. Chase that strike three. Third punch out for Waters. Two down. Base is empty for run to third. Two for four with an RBI double and a single today. Grounded out last time up. Now she's tense again. Four seamer down and in on the first pitch. Hitting the hole to first. Physique over. Backhands cleanly. Races to the bag. He'll win the foot race. And that ends the inning. Another one, two, three inning for Waters as he faced six batters. Set all six of them down. To the ninth, it's eight to one. And my controller is dying. Yay. Nicholson, JYJ, and Nutmeg do up. Here's Nicholson, one for three with a single today. D going for the save here. Fastball taken low, ball one. Cut her up, strike call, one one. Change of away is outside, two one to Nicholson. Change of away, strike call, two two. Fastball up, fouled off late, out of play, two two. Fastball down in the way, hit by Nicholson to left center. Going over for it is going to be the left fielder. Jones, one down. Next up, JYJ, one for three with the triple earlier. DH still has power as lefty active here. Cutter up the way, strike call, 0 1. Fastball down, grounded the second slowly. Cartman makes the stop, two down. Last chance for the saw in game one today is Nutmeg, one for three with an RBI ground out and a single. Change it down, pull down the right field line. That is going to be a fair ball into the corner. 
Extra bases for Nutmeg as she's already around first. Ganez gets it in, but it is a double that keeps the game alive. Sends it back to Trips. 3-4 today with three singles at the top of the lineup. As coming out of the bullpen for D as she will not get the save is Dura Neverwalker, the other ace reliever, as he's just trying to slam the door. D goes three and a third, plus three hits, two strikeouts. She's locked in, runner at second, her responsibility. Neverwalker trying to strand the inherited runner and just nail the door shut. Curveball from the first pitch, hitting the hole off the third baseman. Good dive by Runda, but she couldn't make the play. First and third now, fourth hit for Trips. He's four for five. He's locked in. Two on, two down for Pete Physique, who singled last time up. He's one for four. Majiko do up next. I will pinch hit with Goose Caboose if he does come up. Two seamer up and in. Strike call from Neverwalker, 0 1. Two seamer down and in. Jammed him to second. Cartman to first. That ends the game. Sawteeth drop game one of the doubleheader here to open the season 8 to 1 as the defending champs are shellacked. Granted, the same thing happened last year on opening day against the Sterlins where we dropped the first game and barely won the second game, so we'll see if history repeats itself. 8 1 the final. Uh, hitless today for us were Renero and Majika who didn't bat. Um, only RBI was on the ground out by Nutmeg. Four hit day for trips, two hit day for Nutmeg. Everyone else only managed one measly hit. For the Sirloins, their only hitless batter was Willard Wiggins. They had a two-run homer from Filet Jones, a two-run double from Filet Jones, a two -run, a solo homer from Boozle Doozy Shine, and an RBI single from Doozy Shine as well. Run to third had an RBI double, and JYS had an RBI single. Pitching lines, AVA goes three and a third. He gets killed, nine hits, two walks, seven straw hern runs, four strikeouts, he one homer, he falls to 0-1. Goatman, two and two-thirds out of the pen, four hits, an earned run, a strikeout, a homer, and Everett Waters, two scoreless, three up, three down innings, three strikeouts recorded for him. On the other side for the Sirlins, O gets the win, five and a third, eight hits, one and run, three strikeouts, he improves the one and O. D threw, fell one out shy of her first save of the year, she goes three and a third, three hits, two strikeouts, and never walk her a third of an inning, giving up a hit. Player of the game, Filet Jones, for a trip being a triple shy of the cycle, driving in four of their eight runs. Doozy Shine, two RBIs driven in, and Donko with his pitching performance. Fantastic start to the year, guys. We're looking great. It's like we never even woke up from our fever dream of winning the title last year. Excellent, excellent. A couple players have been posting bad knock-knock jokes on social media. Who do you confront? So let's do the rookie midtown. She's got to earn her keep here. Don't want to piss off uh, um, Friedman just yet. Team slideshow projector is not working again, and you have some really great vacation photos to share. Who's you putting on IT duty? Caboosler. He's not going to play as much as JYJ. All right, looking around the league. Any roster moves made? Yes, there are. First up, dozen rolls plus four fielding. Nice. Wish it was hitting, but... I'll take what I get. Let's see. A couple player opportunities here. JYJ gets plus three speed on a random roll. Nice. B will sign Shania Burns. The starter replaces Deshaun Levon in their rotation. And Ace Von Aysen gets plus two junk on a random roll despite getting killed today. Hey, we'll take it. Every little bit helps, right? All right. B will's taking on the heaters here. B will's do win nine to eight. Herbus Grass Eaters beat the Sandcats 5 0. Hot Corners Rally and do beat the Wild Pigs 7 2, the final there. Crocs taking on the Overdogs here. Crocs win 8 4 over the Overdogs. And the Nemesis win Pitchers Duel against Grapplers 2 1. Freebooters taking on the Moonstars. Good Pitchers Duel, but the Moonstars do win 3 2. Moose taking on the Blowfish. And Blowfish Rally, but drop it to the Moose 6 5. Wide loads and buzzards. Buzzards rally and win 4 to 3 over the wide loads in a nice pitcher's duel. Platypie take it on the overdogs here, and the overdogs win 7 to 3 as they split that seas. Alright, game two. Cecil Sawyer on the mound, left hander versus Joffrey Rockman, the left hander for the sirloins, as both will be making the start. Player development, any moves I can make here, real quick? I can't afford this one, but I'm not giving Wild Throw to Cul de Sac, especially since she 
can have a good arm in the future. Uh, Kabooster, plus four contact. He could use it, not going to lie, but he is a bench bat. Remember that. He doesn't play a whole lot. JYJ, don't want to give him, especially since he has a chance to play catcher. The arm uh, wild thrower trait, that's bad. RH4, chance to get a screwball. That is nice. I like that. BH4, this will be here next time. Chance to get a lead fastball. Hmm. Solid, solid. Velocity and junk for RH4. Hmm. And trips, bonus fielding, which he doesn't really need, but it's nice to have. Okay. Well, if we're going to play this logically, the one with the highest chance to expire is RH4, so we're going to get his. So that makes the most sense. So one VLO to 61, one junk to 66. Going for the three VLO bonus, he's going to get it. He's up to 64 now. Nice. Does not get the screwball, though, which would have been nice to add to his pitch repertoire. Still, he's now a solid B, so we'll take that. Buying two games. Might be buying this one next for Caboosler. Nope, two games. We'll, we'll be able to afford this one for trips, though, so we might get that one next since none of the others will be, like, you know, available. All right. So we know it's Sawyer versus Rockman here in game two. Lineup will be trips leading off in center, locked in. Bags and right batting second. Freeman batting third at second base. Physique batting fourth at first base. Fry batting fifth behind the dish. Renero batting sixth at shortstop. Nicholson batting 7th in left field. JYJ getting the start against another left-hander. He'll bat 8th at DHing. And batting ninth will be 3rd baseman Kira Nutmeg. It's basically almost the exact same lineup, just a few tweaks. Physique moves down some slots as well as Renero and Fry. Friedman and Bags move up. And bottom three are still the same. The leadoff man is still the same. All right. Let's go. Get it on. Looking at the lineup for the Sirloins, it is... Almost the exact same, one difference. McSteel is getting the start at first base here as Doozy Shine moves to third. Run to third moves to shortstop. So Willard Wiggins is out. Um, Jones moves up to the cleanup slot being locked in. Hackman falls to the five. Ginez up to the six. Steele's batting seventh. Ball is still eighth. Cartman still nine. And the top three are still the same in their Sirloin's lineup as well. All right, let's get it on. Trips, bags, and Friedman do up against Rockman. There's Trips leading off 4 for 5 in the first game here. So this is not a day-night doubleheader, unfortunately, as this is on two different day games, So, but it is the doubleheader opening series. Trips won 4 for 5 on the opening day. Heater up and away high, ball 1. Heater away, caught the outside corner, 1-1. One, one. Rockman down to 3 pitches now as he's down to a fastball slider ch changeup. I believe he had a curveball or he had another fastball, I forget which. But he definitely had more than three pitches last I remembered. Really starting to regress. Heater up and away. Crushed by trips to right center field. That's got some carry, but it is run down by ball in at the wall. One down. Johnny Bags up next. One for four in the opening day game. Change of up and in. Strike call. Though one. Heater in there at the letters. Away. 0-2. Oh, Slider down and in. Bloop to left center field. Sinking quickly. Getting there. Sliding as Jones to make the nice catch. Two down. Base is empty for Friedman as gives his customary shout. He's 1 for 4. Start the season. Slider inside, strike called, 0 1. Heater up, taken high, 1 1. Change bump and in, bloop foul, out of play on the left side, 1 2. Slider down and then popped it up, jammed him to first. Off for it is Steele. Nick makes the catch, 1-2-3 inning for Rockman. Bottom one, it's scoreless. JYS third and Doozy Shine up first against Cecil Sawyer. JYS, power contact is lefty active here to start the day. He went two for five in the first game with an RBI single and a double. Facing Cecil Sawyer is making his first start of the season. Cutter up in on the first pitch, foul back, a one in contact versus lefty still has the max boost for it here. Receiver away, check swing outside, 1-1. One, one. Slide it down and in. Low 2 1. Pussy me down. Chased, fouled off by JYS. 2 2. He's bumping in. Chased, foul. Still 2 2. Cut her up and away. High 3 2. Good take. Pussy me middle of the plate. Blow up by him. Strike 3. First punch up for Sawyer as he hits 1 1 on the gun. Run to third up next. She's 10th. Hitting 2 for 5 on the season. At an RBI double and a single. Slide it down on the first pitch, taking low. Ball one. 
Cut her middle plate. Foul back. Thank God she missed it. 1 1. Change up away. Hit up the middle of the second. Free even over. Backhands it cleanly. He'll make the play. One down. Or two down in the inning. Here's Boozle Doozy Shine. Went uh, two for four on opening day. He had a uh, solo homer and an RBI single. Receiver up and in. Foul back. 0 1. He's bit the knees. Line at the middle base hit. Third hit of the year for Doozy Shine. His first hit today for either club. He's on with two down in the inning. That is going to bring up Flay Jones. Three for four on opening day. He finished a triple shy of the cycle. He had a two run homer and a two run double, driving in four of the eight runs. Still locked in. Cutter down and in. Chase chopped a third. Nutmeg races in. Fires the first. That ends the inning. The pitching from Sawyer to the second. Zeke, Fry, and Renero do up. Pitching from Cecil. I've been calling him Cecil again, haven't I? God damn it. It's Cecil. Peak physique leading off. One for five on opening day. He grounded out to end the game. Change up taken high. Ball one. Fastball way with late. One one. Change up and in out in front of it. Fouled off. One two. Fastball down. Whiffed on it. Strike three. First punch up for Rockman. One down. Kenzie Fry up next. Catcher one for four with a single in the first game. Change up inside and misses. Ball one. Change up again inside. 2 0. Change up middle of the plate. Foul back. 2 1. Change up foul off again early. 2 2. Change up away. Pulled to right field. Base hit for Fry as that's five change up straight from Rockman as she finally caught up to it. She's on with one down. First hit today for us. Here's Renero. He went 0 for 4 in the 0 for 3 in the first game and was subbed off. Tense. There's a though for four. You know, who cares? Heater high. Ball one. Heater up and in. Strike called. One one. Fastball up. Whiff late. One and two. Slider down and then chopped through the middle right under the wickets of Rockman. Two on. One down. First hit of the year for Renero. He was the only starter to be hitless for us in game one. Rookie Holly Nicholson up next went one for four in her debut with a single. Trying to drive in a run here. Change of up, strike called. Letters, a one. Slider down in the way. Nicholson goes with it to left field off the end of the bat. Right at Filet Jones. Two down. Two still on for the saw teeth here. That's going to bring up JYJ, the DH. He went one for four with a triple and a run scored in the first game. Tavers lefty still active here. Slider from away, ripped the first under the glove of mixed steals. He couldn't quite knock it down. That is going to be an E3 as JYJ reaches. Base is loaded two down for Nutmeg, who had an RBI ground out in the first game. She went two for four. Two singles, trying to drive in some more runs. Heater up, taken high, ball one. Heater away outside, 2-0 to Nutmeg. Slider hangs, fouled back over the screen, 2-1. Fastball down with late 2 2. Change up, up, pulled the second one, hopper to Cartman, and will strand the bases loaded in the second. Bottom two, it's still scoreless here. Hackman, Ganez, and Steele do up. There's Hackman, one for three in the first game. He also walked, scored twice. Forcing the middle of the plate, line to right center, extra bases for Hackman, his first extra base hit of the year. Bags gets to it and gets it in quickly, but it is still a leadoff double for Hackman. Running scoring position for Gabby Ganez. Right fielder went one for four in the first game with a single. Change it down, low and away, ball one. Receiver up, taken high, 2-0. -oh. Light up and away, fouled off, 2-1. Cut her down and in. Fouled off. Jander, 2-2. Two -two. Jay Collector active. Change it down the way. Chased it, strike three. Second punch up for Sawyer. One down. Next up, Mick Steele, the first baseman. He's tense, getting his first appearance of the season. He made an error in the first inning. Force him down. Taking low. Ball one. Cut her up and away. Sky to left center. Nicholson retreating. 
Makes the catch. Two down. Hackman remains in second for Ballin. Center fielder one for three in the first game. She also walked. Slider down and in on the first pitch. Strike called. 0-1. Change of a way. Sky to right field hit pretty well. Bags retreating back to right. Makes the catch at the warning track to end the inning. Good stranding there by Sawyer to the third. It's scoreless. Trips, Bags, and Friedman do up. There's Trips over one today. Glad his first time up. Slider is low. Ball one. Fastball inside misses from Rockman. 2-0. Change but way ripped down the left field line. Fair ball into the corner as Trips is going to have extra bases. Jones just getting to it. He'll get it in with Noodle Arm activating. It is a leadoff double for Trips here in the third. He's locked in. Here's Johnny Bags over one. Out of that, his first time up. Here and there, start called away. 0 1. Change but way dumped off the end of the bat to right center. That is down for a hit. Trips around third. He's going to score easily. First RBI of the year for Johnny Bags. 1 0 Sawteeth as we have our first lead of the season. 1 0. Here's Friedman over one. Heater up, taking high. Ball one. Change up and way outside high. 2 0 the count to Friedman. Good hitters count. Slider up. Crushed by Friedman late. Out of play. 2 1. Fastball down and the changeup down and then ripped hard to left field base hit. Friedman keeps it going. That's three straight hits to start the inning for the saw teeth. Two on, none down. Here's Peak Physique who's over one. Down and out his first time up. Slider away. Strike called. A one. Fastball down and then ripped by Physique to the gap right center field. That's going to get another one home at least. This is going to be extra bases. One run is in. Second runner coming around as well as Friedman. It is a two-run double here for Physique. Three, nothing salty. This Friedman just beats the throw in. Kenzie Fry on next one for one with a single. She's locked in. And that'll do it for Joffrey Rockman. He's immediately pulled after giving up four straight hits to start the third. He only goes two plus today. Six hits, three earned runs, and a strikeout. Coming out of the bullpen is Dern Neverwalker. who got the last out in the first game, giving up a hit, and then um, getting a ground out to end the game. He's got no ERA and a three whip. Second appearance already of the year for Neverwalker. Runner at second will be um, Rockman's responsibility if he scores. Fry is locked in. One for one today with a single. Two for five on the year. Pass down and then whiff late. 0 1. Pass up. Whiff late. 0 2. Curble down and then pulled to right field right at Ganez for the first out of the inning. Next up is John Ranero, one for one with the singles. He's back to neutral mojo. Fork ball down, sky to right field into the corner. Ganez over to make the catch for the second out. Runner tags and heads for third. Relay throw in is going to be late as easily advancing his physique. He is at third with two down for Holly Nicholson. Rookie flew out last time up. She's 0 for 1. Slider, curveball in the dirt away, bounces, ball one. Curveball up and away, inside, up and in, actually inside. 2 0 to Nicholson. Curveball up, ripped a short base hit for Nicholson. Her first career RBI coming in. It is 4 0 Salt Teeth. That run is charged to Rockman. He'll finish with four earned runs. JYJ up next, 0 for 1. First bat of the year without power versus lefty active here. Fastball up and in with Flade, 0 1. Fastball up and in with Flade again, 0 2. Never walk her ahead here. Fastball up, whiffed on it, strike three. First punch up for Neverwalker, that ends the inning. But four runs in the inning as the Sawteeth knock Rockman out of the game. Four nothing to the bottom of the third. Cartman, JYS, and third do up against Sawyer, who now is pitching with the lead. Cartman leading off, nine hitter, one for four on opening day with a single. Cut her down in the way in the first pitch, strike called from Cecil, a one. Four seamer up, taken way high, one one. Slider down and in. Cartman chops it in the hole to first. Physique over. Bare hands flips to Sawyer in time. One down. JYS up next. He's over one today with a strikeout. Cutter down in the way in the first pitch. Taken low. Ball one. Change of middle in. JYS rips it in the gap left center. 
That is going to be down, and that will roll all the way to the fence there next to the Boston Crab sign. That will be a one-out double here for JYS as he's in scoring position for the Sirloins. And he got injured on the play as well. The 45-year-old comes up limping after the slide. Here's third over one today. Pinched running for him is backup catcher Momo Tobos. He'll take over. What happened to the injury? Pulled his hammy running into second. That is a shame. 45-year-old's going to be on the shelf. Run to third coming up next uh, over one today. She'll face Sawyer. Four-seamer middle win. Whiffed on it. A one out behind it. Slided down the way. Low and outside. 1-1. One, one. Cutter inside. Misses. 2-1. Change up and away, fouled off, 2-2. Two -two. Okay, collector active for Sawyer here. Where's he down and in? Chop foul, we'll do it again, still 2-2. Two -two. Slider down and away. Whiffed on it, strike three below the knees. Third punch out for Sawyer. Two down in the inning for Doozy Shine. One for one with the single, he's locked in. Change up and in on the first pitch, strike called as it floats in there, 0-1. Cutter down in the way. Chased it low, 0-2. Okay, collector active again for Sawyer here. Or seam up and away. Loop down the right field line. Just foul by inches, 0-2. Slide it down and in. Fouled off. We'll do it again. Still 0-2. Cutter down in the way. Chased it outside, strike three. Fourth punch up for Sawyer. That ends the inning as he strands a runner at second. But JYS hits the double and comes up lame. He pulls his hamstring to the fourth. 4-0 four the score. Nutmeg trips and bags. Do up. Nutmeg leading off 0-for-1 today. Third baseman flew out with the bases loaded her first time up. Momotomo coming out of the bench here after pinch running last inning. He'll take over at catcher for the injured JYS. Heater down and in low. Ball one. Curb off and in is pulled to first. Easy catch for steal. One down. Here's Trips, 1-2 with the double today. Double last time up and scored a run. First the bat uh, hitting uh, right-handed here. That's in the dirt at the knees, 0-1. Chased away, fouled off late, 0-2. Work well down the way, hit up the line, foul again. 0-2 remains the count here to Trips. Two-seamer away is hit off the end of the bat to left of center. Easy catch for Ballin, two down in the inning. Here's Johnny Bags, 1 for 2 with an RBI six. single last time up. He also scored a run. Heater down and then strike called, 0 1. Turbo down, chopped under the glove with Never Walker up the middle. Third cuts it off. That's a 1 2 3 inning for Never Walker. Bottom four, it's still 4 0. Jones, Hackman, and Ganez do up. Jones leading off. He's 0 for 1 today. Grounded out the third his first time up. Facing Sawyer is now locked in. Cutter down and away in the first pitch, just low, ball one. Change it down and in, out in front of it, 1-1. One, one. Receiver up and in, strike called, 1-2. Slider away, fouled off, still 1-2. and two. Cutter up and in, fouled off late, still 1-2. and two. Four me down and in. Chop jammed him the first. Physique racing in. Bare hands. Flips to the pitcher. In time. One down. Next up, Hackman. One for one with the double today. Slider down in the way in the first pitch. Just low. Ball one. Four seamer down and in. Hit on the ground to first. Right at Physique on the backhand. He'll race to the bag. Two down. Took it himself. Next up, Ganez. 0 for one. Change up on the first pitch. Out in front of it. 0-1. Cut her down in the way, fouled off late, 0-2. Or seamer up, taken high and away, 1-2. Slider down and in, inside, 2-2. Cut her inside, misses, 3-2. Or seamer down in the way, chased outside, will foul it off, do it again. Count remains full. Payoff pitch coming, change up up, taken high, ball four. First walk for Sawyer as he lost Ganez. That extends the inning for Mick Steele, 0 for 1. Change it down the way in the first pitch. Low, ball 1, no call. 
Four seamer middle in, bloop down the left field line, just foul. One and one. Cutter up and away. Check swing strike, one and two. Slider down and away in the dirt. Good block by Fry, two two. Four seamer at the knees. Steel hits it hard at the middle base hit. That'll keep the inning alive here with two down. Two on for the Sirlins. Is that'll bring up the eight hitter. Sawyer no longer locked in. It's ball in 0 for 1. Cutter up and in on the first pitch ball and check swing strike call. The one. Change it middle way. Bloop foul out of play. 0 2. Four seamer up. High. 1 2. Slider down and in. Low and inside. 2 2. Cutter at the knees away, fouled off, still two and two. Let's see him up and in, chase it inside, strike three, fifth punch up for Sawyer, that ends the inning. To the fifth, it's still 4 0. Friedman, physique, and fry, do up. Here's Janice Friedman, one for two with a single last time up, he also scored a run. Curl down on the way, chopper to second, slow roller, Cartman makes the play, one pitch, one out. Peak physique up next, two run double last time up, he's one for two. You see me up and away, strike called, 0 1. Curveball up and in, blooped over second to right, shallow. In on the sliding Ganez as she basically knees Cartman in the face but makes the catch. Two down. Fry up next, 1 for 2 with a single. Peter inside misses on the two seamer, ball one. Curveball hangs, Fry hits it off the end of the bat to right. This is an easy play for Ganez as she barely has to move. 1 2 3 inning for Neverwalker in the fifth. Bottom five, it's 4 0. Cartman, Tobo, and third do up. Here's Cartman of one today. Forcing the middle in on first pitch, strike call, 0 1. Sawyer still locked in on the mound. Just keeping the jam last inning. Slider down in the way is fouled off, 0 2. Cutter away. Chased it, fouled off again, still 0 2. Forcing her up and in. Jammed his bat, broke it, fouled off. We'll do it again, get him some new lumber. Count remains 0-2. Change it down and in. Chased inside. Fouled off again. Still 0-2. Slider down and in. Low. 1-2. and two. Four seamer away. Check swing outside. 2-2. Two, two. Cutter up and away. Cartman hits up the middle base hit to right center. Trips cuts it off. That'll keep it from being extra bases. Lead off man on in the fifth for the sirloins. Next up is Tobo, first at bat of the year for the catchers. He came in for the injured JYS, who hit a double last time up, but pulled his hamstring running the second. Forcing her away on the first pitch, runner goes, strike called, throw down by Fry. No chance to get Cartman with good speed, his first steal of the year. A one the count. Better down in the dirt, off the glove of Fry. Cartman digging for third, he will get there on the wild pitch. One, one. Slider down and in, in the dirt, could block, 2-1. Receiver away, crushed the right center field, hit pretty well, trips giving chase, lays out, makes the catch against the wall, but the runner tags and will score. Sack fly for Tobo, it is 4-1. One. one down in the inning, here's third, 0 for 2. Change it down the way, low, ball 1. Receiver middle in, strike call, 1-1. One, one. 80th pitch of the day for Sawyer. Cutter up and in, taken high. 2 1. Change it down the way. Chop the second. Slow roller. Freeman races in. Makes the play. 2 down. Here's Doozy Shine. 1 for 2 with a single. Slider down and in on the first pitch. Chop foul out of play. 0 1. Force him down the way. Low and outside. 1 1. Cutter up and in. Chased foul back. 1 and 2. Change up, taking high, 2 2. Four seamer down and away. Strike three called. Six punch up for Sawyer. That ends the inning, but he does give up his first run on the sack fly by Tobo. 4 1 to the sixth. Renero, Nicholson, and JYJ do up. Sawyer's going to be down here after five innings. He's up near 90 pitches, but still solid outing nevertheless. Just pitch count got to him today. Renero leading off, 1 for 2 with a single. Uh, he's now tense again. Heater up and away, taking high for Never Walker. Ball one. Curveball down in the way, sky to right center, running it down, his ball in, in the gap. One down here in the sixth. 
Nicholson up next, one for two with a solo RBI single. Last time up for the rookie, her first career RBI. Two seamer outside, misses ball one. That's low with the knees, strike called, one one. Pass up with late, one and two. Work well up, hard chopper in the hole, base hit for Nicholson. Pass both diving infielders to left. Her second hit of the day, she's two for three. Good day for the rookie, her first career multi hit game. Here's JYJ, who's over two. Four seamer up, strike called from Never Walker, 0 1. Curble down and in, bloop the short over the uh, glove of the shortstop. That's a base hit. First and second now with one down. First hit for JYJ. Two on, one down for Nutmeg, 0 for 2. Peter up and in, taking high, ball one. Fastball up, blooped over the short. That's down in left center for a base hit. Nicholson coming around third. She's going to score easily. Throw from Jones goes to second. It is an RBI single for Nutmeg. Runners at the corners, 5-1. We're back to a four-run lead. Trips up next, one for three with a double. Looking to break it open. He's locked in. Never Walker staying out there despite being a little gassed. Infield in, trying to keep the run from scoring. Heater up and away, strike called, 0-1. Heater up the way, bloop to left field on the liner, base hit. Trips gets his sec first RBI of the game. It is six to one. Two on, one down, still for Bags. One for three with an RBI single, and that'll do it for Never Walker. He leaves tense, coming out of the bullpen. Long reliever, third year man, splits Seamerson, an original Sirlins member, making his season debut. The injury prone long reliever comes out, looking to keep the runs from getting out of hand here. One in already home in the inning, both on base would be charged to Never Walker. Johnny Bags getting his action here. He's one for three. Change him up and in strike call to one. Screwball down in the way, bloop to short. That's on the ground. Third on to first on the fielder's choice. Two down. Second and third here for Freeman, looking to break it open. One for three with a single. Slider middle in, line to left center, he got it, timed it up perfectly, that's going to be extra bases. Friedman will walk into second with a two-run double, it is eight to one, Sawteeth oh, slides in safely. Here's Peak Physique, one for three, two-run double back in the south third inning of the game. Checks me outside on the change of good take, ball one. Screwball down and in, grounded a short, slow roller, third to first, that ends the inning. But three home in the inning for the Sawteeth. We're up to a seven-run lead now. 8-1 to the bottom of the sixth. Jones, Hackman, and Ganez do up. Here's Jones over two today. I'm going to let Sawyer go now that we got a big lead. Let's give him a shot at it at least. Gives up a base runner. He's coming out. First pitch grounded to first. Physique takes it himself. One down. Sawyer locked in. Here's Hackman. One for two with a double. Cutter down and away. Low ball one. Horse him up. Checks me high. 2-0. Slider down and in. Hackman ripped foul. 2 1. Cut her up. Middle of the plate. Ground hard to third. Right at Nutmeg. And she makes an error. Right under the glove of Nutmeg. E5. Runner reaches with one down. Here's Ganez over one to walk. I'll let Sawyer go. That wasn't his fault. That should have been an out. Slider down. Chopped in the hole to first. Past the diving physique. Past the diving Freeman. Another base hit. First and second now with one down. And now we are going to take out Sawyer. He's no longer locked in. Steal one for two with a single. He's ten. Sawyer done after five and a third. Six. Oh, he has rally stopper though. One at bat. That's all he gets. Six hits so far. An earned run. A walk. Six strikeouts. Trying to keep it from getting any worse. Over 90 pitches now. Slider in the dirt. Ball one. Change it down in the way. Just low. No call. 2-0. Cutter middle in. Inside 3-0, no call from the ump. Or seamer up with the letters. Steel takes 3-1. Slider down the way. Steel whiffs through it. Full count. Change of bumping in. Bloop down the line. Still foul. Payoff pitch coming one more time. Cutter up and away. Chased it strike three. Punch out for Sawyer, his seventh. Two down. Here's ball and 0 for two. One more from me, Cecil. Here's pitch number 100. Horse him down. Strike called at the knees. 0-1. Change of open in. Taking high. 1-1. Cutter up and away. High. 2-1. Slider down. Chased. Foul off. 2-2. Two -two. 
Receiver down and away. Outside, 3-2. Runners will be off. Cutter middle of the plate. Line to left field. Nicholson going over. Lays out. Off the glove of the rookie. She went for the slide. Could not make the catch. Two runs are going to score on the single. It is 8-3. Good effort from Nicholson. Trying to get Sawyer the quality start, but just couldn't get it done. Cartman up one for two with a single. Sawyer down after five and two-thirds. He gives up seven hits, one earned run. Those two that scored are unearned. A walk, seven strikeouts. Just can't get this line. You know what? Fuck it. Why not? Meter up and away. Strike call to one. Got our middle of the plate. Line through the middle base hit. Yeah, we got to take him out now. It's getting ugly. Damn shame. That error cost him. He would have had the quality start. Tobo with the sack fly last time up is up next. Five and two-thirds for Sawyer today. Eight hits and earned run and walk. Seven strikeouts. He's coming out here. We're going to go to the bullpen. We're going to go to the right-hander here, or RH4. Rob Hurlington the fourth as he'll come out of the bullpen make his debut on the season. Mr. Consistent, who just got the velocity and junk boost here. First him down and in, in the dirt. Good block, ball one. Put about the knees. Fouled off late, 1-1. One, one. Or seamer up and away. Check swing high, 2-1. Slider up. Checks high, 3-1. Or seamer middle of the plate. Tobo down the right field line into the corner. Extra bases. That's going to get at least two home, and it's going to be 8-5. Throw to second is late. Two-run double for Tobo. He's driven in three runs today. Serling's back in the game now. Here's run to third. 0 for 3 intense. Ball down, low, ball one. So we're down and in. No call, inside, 2-0. Slider down, low, 3-0. Come on, ump, give me a fucking break. Peter down and away, there's a strike, 3-1. Slider middle away, strike, full count. Let's see, we're up and in. Loop to left center, another base hit, and another run is going to score. It is eight to 8-6 as we're falling apart. All because of one error at third base, Nutmeg. This is all on you. Doozy Shine up next, one for three with a single. No earned runs in the inning. Curve ball bloop down the right field line. Foul. 0-1. Arlington is tense, though. We're down and in. Strike call, 0-2. Slider up and away. Way outside. 1 2. The ball down and away. In the dirt. 2 2. We're seeing up and in. Inside. Full count. Payoff pitch coming. Slider down and in. Low and inside. Ball four. Keep the train rolling, boys. Back to Jones, who led off the inning. Fighting crane active for the Sirloins. They batted around. Slider down and away. Outside ball one. Jones grounded at the first to start the inning. First hit down and away. Hard grounder to second. Pass the diving. Freeman base hit. First hit today for Jones. Runner's going to score. It is going to be 8-7. to seven. Runners at the corners with two down. Here's Hackman. One for three with a double. Slider down and away. Outside ball one. Seam up and in. Whiffed on it. 1-1. One, one. Hackman reached on an error. Turbo down and in in the dirt. 2 1. So we're down and away. Line to second. Diving Friedman out of his reach. We're tied at eight. They have come back with seven runs in the inning because of Nutmeg's error. Here's Ganez. 1 for 2 with a single and a walk. Still no earned runs in the inning, guys. Fastball up and away. Strike called. 0 1. Third ball away. Loop to center. Trip's coming in. He's not going to get there. Runner holds, base is loaded. Still two outs. Still two outs. Here's Steele, one for three with a single pinch hitting Willard Wiggins with RBI hero. He's tense, he went hitless in the first game, he was on the bench. First pitch slider down and away, low and outside, ball one. Four senior inside, 2-0. Ball up, sky to right center, Bags is over. Calling for it. Puts it away to finally end the inning. But seven unearned runs score thanks to an error by Kira Nutmeg at third base. And I can tell you this is all her fault because no earned runs were charged to Hurlington or Sawyer in that inning. To the seventh, it's 8-8. Eight to eight. 
Fry, Renero Nicholson do up in a brand new ball game. Thank you, Kira. Thank you. Fry one for three today with a single. Powers Ray still active. Wiggins remains in the game at first base after pinch hitting for steal. That's in the dirt. Ball one. Pitch for Seamerson. Heater down in the way. Low. Not in the dirt this time, but still low. 2 0. Change down and then rip foul out in front of it. 2 1. Fastball middle in. Whiff late. 2 2. Fastball down. Hard liner to third. Right at Doozy Shine. One down. See? Nutmeg, their third baseman can catch. Here's Renero, one for three with a single. He's still tense. Slider inside, strike called, 0-1. Change of chase inside, 0-2. Pork ball middle in, bloop to left center field. That is down, and that will roll to the fence. That'll be extra bases for Renero. So he'll be on with a one-out double here in the seventh. Go ahead, run in scoring position for Nicholson. She singled home a run earlier in the game. She also singled last time up. She's two for three today. It's her first career multi-hit game. Screwball up, strike called with letters, a one. Slider down, hit on the ground to second. That'll advance the runner. Cartman to first, two down. Right arrow to third on the play. Here's JYJ with the RBI chance. One for three with a single. Screwball up and away, strike called with letters, a one. Fastball up, line to right field, base hit for JYJ. He'll drive home. Renero, Salty 3 take the lead 9 to 8. Third baseman, number 15. Nutmeg singled home a run last time up. She's 1 for 3 today, but she made an error in the field, and she's now 10. So she allowed those 7 unearned runs to score last inning. Heater up, taking high, ball 1. Change up and away high. 2 0 to Nutmeg. Good hitters count. She ain't going to do anything with it, though. Pork ball hangs, line down the left field line. Look at that. You made up for it. Into the corner. That'll be extra bases. Runner coming around third. He's going to try it. Relay throw from third. No shot at getting JYJ. It's an RBI double for Nutmeg. 10 to 8. Trips up next. 2 for 4. RBI single last him up. He's also doubled today. He's locked in. And they intentionally walk trips. I don't blame him. He's our best hitter. Two on, two down for Bags. Clutch active for him. He's won fourth on RBI single today. Can Bags do it again here? Either way, checked outside. Good take, ball one. Screwball high. Good take, 2 0. Slider up and away. Crushed by Bags to left center, but he got under it. Ball and over for it. Puts it away to end the inning. Two in for the Saltitos. We retake the lead. 10-8 to the bottom of the seventh. Ball and Cartman and Toba do up. RH4 is now actually the pitcher of record, but he is not pitching the next inning as he got shellacked and threw 30 pitches that inning. There's Ball and 1-3 with two RBIs on a single last time up. Going to the bullpen. Coming out is his twin brother, Bob Hurlington, the fourth BH4. The lefty and Mr. Volatile coming out. First pitch, four-seamer away. Line down the line by Ball and on the right side, but fouled off, the one Change it down and in. Chop, slow roller up the middle. Renero dives, cuts, well, got glove to it, but it's an infield single regardless as he couldn't knock it down. He's on. Leadoff man on in the inning for Cartman. Two for three with two singles. Hey, Loai, how's it going, buddy? Yeah, we got a game again. We gave up seven unearned runs in the sixth thanks to one error at third base by Nutmeg. We had an 8 1 lead going into that inning. Yeah, we suck. Yeah, I do, don't I? Uh, first game we lost today, 8-1, uh, to one, so trying to even the doubleheader here. 27-1? to one? Oh, my God, what happened? Yeah, we both suck. We both suck. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. I don't think I've ever lost that badly. Then again, the grass eaters exist, so maybe I have, and I just don't want to talk about it. Slider away. Strike call to Nut Cartman as we get ahead here, 0-1. Fastball inside, line to second. Freeman lunges out of his reach, another hit. Digging for third is the runner, throw is cut. Running first and third now with none down. Good aggressive running there from Ballin. Here's Tobo. Two run double last time up. He's also had a sack fly today, driving in three, and clutch is active. Force him down in the way from Bob. Strike call, 0 1. Slider inside, almost nut tapped his ass, missed 1 1. Change it down and in. Rip foul. 1 2. Out in front of it. Rosemary up and away. 
Way outside, T2. Nowhere near the zone. That didn't even threaten it. Where's him? They're up. Way high. 3 2. Slider away, and that's chased. Thank you, Tobo. First punch out for BH4. One down. Here's third. One fourth an RBI single today. Change it down on the first pitch. Low ball one. Or senior middle in. Third rips it to third. Under the nutmeg's diving glove, and that's a base hit. A run scores. It's 10 to 9. Serlin's back within a run. Two on, two down. One down still for Doozy Shine. Walk last him up. He's also hit a single. One for three today. BH4 now tense after giving up the run. Slider down and in. The downside of all tile, unfortunately. Slider in there at the knees inside. 0 1. Or senior away. Bowed off late. 0 2. Almost broke the bat. Change of away. Outside, 1 2. Or seamer up and in. Fouled off, still 1 and 2. Slider down. Chase, chop, slow roller to first. Physique taps the bag for the second out throw to second is late. Fielder's choice, 2 down, 2 in scoring position for Filet Jones. 1 4 with an RBS single last time up. Change up up on the first pitch. Popped up. Behind the plate, Fry out of the crouch calling for it. And Fry puts it away to end the threat as we do get out of it. Nah, I ain't gonna walk out. I got lucky there. <laughs> indeed, indeed. To the eighth, it's 10 9. Friedman, Physique, and Fry do up. I figure Jones is done hitting homers. He had one in the first game. I think that's his limit. <laughs> Hard to line up up for us here in the eighth as we look for some insurance. Here's Friedman, two for four. Two run double last time up. He's also singled today. Seamerson still tense. Change up is low. Ball one. Change it down and then bloop foul. Out of play. Good effort there by Doozy Shine. 1-1. One, one. Slider middle in. Freeman gets some wood to it, but he got under it. Ball in there in the shade in left center. Puts it away. One down. Now batting the first base, number 33, Peak. Ah, Cheeseburger Jesus. Thank you for the raid, my friend, and welcome everybody to the stream. Hopefully you all enjoy what you see. Uh, we got a tight one here. We're up 10 to 9 here in the eighth, looking for some insurance runs. We already blew a seven run lead today. I'm trying not to do it again, <laughs> but we shall see. We shall see. Thank you guys for the raid. I appreciate it. Seamerson sets, delivers the physique. Slider is outside. Ball one. Physique has one hit today. That changeup got in there on the inside corner. 1 1. Nice pitch there. Slider up and in, bloop to left center, racing out for a third on the dive, no chance. Second hit for Physique, he is on with one down. That might be the start, here's Fry, one for the single. No pitching change, Powers righty will remain active. Popped out to the pitcher last time up, is that changeup, or screwballs inside, ball one from Seamerson. Changeup got me on the front foot, fouled off, 1-1. One, one. Change it down the way. Sky to right center field. Hit pretty well, but again, just under it. Ball in is there. This should be an easy second out, and it is. Now batting the shortstop, number 12. Go complete game in a 1-0 loss. Ugh, sorry to hear that, my friend. That is painful. I've had that happen, though, unfortunately. Renaro up 2-4. Doubled last time up. He's also single, trying to get his third hit of the game. Change it in there at the knees. 0-1, Seamerson ahead. Checked outside, good hold on the slider, 1-1. One, one. Change up an inline to short right at Runda, and that ends the inning, damn it. Bottom eight, it's 10-9. Hackman, Ganez, and Wiggins do up BH4. I need another inning out of you, buddy. Primo can't go six outs today. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Hackman, two for four, RBI double earlier in the game. He's also singled. Peter down, low, ball one. Okay. Ah, uh, change of hangs, but we got lucky off the end of the bat. Trips there in center back a step. Now over to the shade. Puts it away. One down. Got lucky there. Woo. Have I tried Starfield? No, I have not. I'm trying to limit purchases, unfortunately. <laughs> Unless it's on Game Pass, I might consider downloading it. But uh, no, I have not tried it yet, actually. I know it's the no new big thing coming out now with the recent gaming news, so... Uh, Ginez is up next. Right fielder has two hits today. Good day for Gabby at the plate. Change up is low. Ball one. Four seamer inside. Takes a strike to the right fielder. 1-1. One, one. 
Slide up and in. Ganez takes a strike at the letters this time. One, two. Hurlington ahead. Orsi up and away. Blew it by her strike three. Second punch up for BH4. Two down in the inning. Oh, it is on Game Pass. Perfect. I might try it. I'll see if I have the room to download it. <laughs> might have to cut some stuff. Wiggins up next. He pinch hit and flew out with the bases loaded his first time up. He's 0 for 1 and still tense. Change it down and then out in front of it. 0-1 as he almost killed his teammates. Heads up in there. Or Seamer away. Whiffed on it. 0-2. Looking, looking silly out there. Slider up and away. That's way high. Chased it anyway. Strike three. Back-to-back -back case for Hurlington. He's up to three punch outs today. He gets through the eighth without issue. 10 to ninth. It's still 10 to nine. Bottom of the lineup up. Nicholson, JYJ, and Nutmeg who put us in this situation to begin with with that error. PS raised our prices to give us jack shit. Sounds about right. <laughs> That sounds like a Sony move. Here's Nicholson, two for four, two singles and an RBI today. Rookie's first career multi-hit game and also her first RBI driven in earlier, facing Seamerson for the second time today. Change of middle end, strike call, 0-1. That's outside this time on the changeup, 1-1. Slider up, chased, fouled off late, out of play, 1-2. Nicholson behind. Chased it high strike through. Damn it, got me with that fastball. Seamerson's first punch out today. JYJ up next. RBI knock last time up for Junior. Stoop four today. Two singles. Screwball inside. Strike call. 0-1. Peter inside. Misses. 1-1. One, one. Change up down. Ripped hard to third. Off the glove of... Uh, fuck, what's his name? Doozy Shine. Infield single. I think that's an E5. Nutmeg up next. 2-4 today. RBI double last time up and an RBI single. Still tense after her fielding error. And coming out of the bullpen is Shade D, who threw three and a third scoreless innings in relief of the starter Donk O in game one. Came one out shy of a save. She's locked in and juiced because she had stimulated, and they go to her immediately despite being pretty much gassed. Seamus and Dunn for three plus innings, five hits, two earned runs, a walk, and a strikeout. And that was an error charged to Doozy Shine. Second error of the game for the Sirloins as uh, Mick Steele made an error in the first inning. Third error overall of the game. We have had a shitty fielding day here in this doubleheader. There was two, one error in game one as well. Three for the Sirloins total. D is locked in and juiced. I don't like that combination. <laughs> Facing Nutmeg. D sets, fires. Peter up and away. Strike call to one. That's just not even fair. Cut her down on the way, hit off the end of the bat, timed it well, just didn't get the wood to it. Ball and makes the catch in center, two down. That is going to bring up the leadoff hitter slash trips the man himself. He intentionally walked last time up. He's doubled in a, doubled and singled in a run. Locked in. No intentional walk, they will pitch to him. Interesting choice. You're up and away. God damn it, just late, 0-1. Oh, Cut her up. Damn it, you bitch. I'm looking low, 0-2. Oh, Almost got me that time. Fouled back. 0-2. Oh, ah! Bastard. Punch out for D, and that ends the inning. Bottom nine. 10-9 the score. Ball and Cartman and Tobo do up. We're going to the closer. Primo coming in. Going for his first save of the year. All right, Primo. Here's Ball and leading off. 2-4, two, two singles. Drove in two runs earlier. Primo coming out of the bullpen looking for this first save of the year in his first appearance. Let's see if he can get it done. Let's close it out. Indeed. Got to go for it. 8-9-1 and one do it for the Serlins here in the ninth. Eater high. Ball one. Change of play. Just outside. 2 -oh. Damn it. Come on. Well, that's in the dirt. Ball three. Christ. We're seeing the middle in. That's a strike. 3-1. Down and in. Chased it. Full count. Thank God. Her ball away. Chased it. Strike three. First punch out for Primo. One down. Nice pitch. Nice pitch. Cartman up next. Three for four day for Carey at the bottom of the lineup. He has three singles. Change up up. Ooh, out on the front foot. He was looking heater. 0-1. Oh, heater up and away. Whiffed on it. 0-2. Oh, now he's late. Her ball down and in. Inside, 1-2. Or seamer up and in. 
Chased it, strike three. Second punch up for Primo. He's feeling it. Two down. Last chance for the heaters in game two is Tobo. One for two with three RBIs today. He doubled in two and hit a sack fly as well. Lined out last time up. Clutch active. And Cartman got hurt on the swing. He strained a muscle in his arm. Well, good thing he doesn't have to bat anymore, at least. I don't think they have another second baseman on the roster. Third can play short. Uh, Doozy Shine could move over, but they don't have another infielder on the bench. They're stuck with Cartman because Hackman is DHing. Unless they want to put the pitcher on the lineup. Oof. Rough. Rough for them. First pitch, curveball down on the way, whiffed on it by Tobo as he's got max boost on the clutch and max pressure as well, so it's double the effect. Christ, he's already a dangerous hitter. Force him down and in, whiffed inside, 0-2. Primo looking for the punch out. Change bumping away, chased it, strike three. Primo strikes out the side in the ninth to nail the door shut. Sawtooth take game two of the doubleheader. We split it one game apiece. This should have been an easy win, but that damn error in the sixth inning by Nutmeg almost fucked us hard, man. Jesus Christ. At least we got out of here with the dub. Ah, messy game all around for both sides. Hitless today. Nobody in our lineup. Everybody got at least one hit. RBIs for Trips, Bags, two for Friedman, two for Physique, one for Nicholson, one for JYJ, and two for Nutmeg. Uh, no homers. We have yet to hit a homer this season. And on the side for the Sirloins, everybody got a hit today except Wiggins, the pinch hitter. Three RBIs for Tobo, two for third, one for Jones, one for Hackman, and two for Ball. And we did keep them from hitting a home run this game at least. GG's, GG's, thank you guys. I do roll with a legit closer because you can't deal with, like, you can't get a guy as good as Primo for free. And basically he is for free at this point because he's still at the same money he was making back in year one. <laughs> Winning pitcher is going to be RH4 despite getting absolutely crapped on today. He gave up five hits and allowed, uh, like, six runs to score in that inning. Hold on. One, two, three. All right, math, he gave up, uh, f he allowed four runs to score that inning, and none of them were earned because of the error. Five hits, a walk, he gets the win. BH4 gets the hold, two innings, three hits, and earned run, three strikeouts, and Primo strikes out the shot in the ninth, getting his first save of the year. Seamerson takes the loss, three innings, five hits, two earned runs, a strikeout, and a walk in relief of Neverwalker and Rockman. Seamerson falls to 0 1. Sawyer, five and two thirds innings, eight hits, earned run, walk, seven strikeouts, he's the player of the game. Tobo at one for three with three RBIs driven in, and then trips the two for five day at the top of the lineup, driving in a run, scoring twice. Not bad. We'll take that dub, thank God. That was messy, but we earned it. All right, so we're one and one. Going for that third straight title to start a series is rough going, but, you know, this is exactly what we did last year on opening day. We lost game one pretty badly, and then we won game two in an ugly fashion, but we did still win. <laughs> and ironically enough, Cecil Sawyer was the pitcher in that second game as well that time, huh? All right, team's retro gaming system is not working again, and you tried blowing on the cartridge. Who's going to fix it? Uh, Rob, you're the one who blew shit the bed worse than your brother today, so you take this penalty. Who is on shower drain duty this week, Physique or Nicholson? Nicholson's been hitting well. Physique, you take this one, buddy. You haven't been hitting well again. Christ. Brovin, what's a new face for the Hyper Cheese campaign? Johnny or AVA? Oof, that's tough. Ace didn't pitch well, and Johnny didn't hit well in either of the two games. Johnny did do better. AVA has lower loyalty, though, and he's the higher-rated player. I think Johnny, he'll be more important to the future moving forward. All right, a lot of games to sim through here real quick. Let's have a look. What do we got? Okay, player opportunity. Stink Ham Steak, picked up by the Freebooters. He'll replace Air Lovestone in their rotation. That's a good move there, I think. Moonstars sign our former outfielder Howie Caldeet. He'll be replacing Windy Wheels in their outfield. Don Turner, the rookie, loses two speed. He's a pitcher. It doesn't matter. And Primo lost his changeup. Are you fucking kidding me, Primo? God damn it. Now you're a two-pitch closer? That's what I absolutely loathe. I need a pitch closer with at least three pitches. Otherwise, I get predictable. All right, let's sum up. <sighs> All right, Moonstars win 3-1 over the Sandcats. Moonstars now 2-0 on the year. They're the only team in our division still undefeated. Crocs easily take care of the Jacks 6-0. Grass Eaters win. Those bastards, they beat the Freebooters. Pigs beat the Moose. Good win for them. Grapplers take care of business against the Bee Wolves. They get their first win. 
Heaters who were in the finals last year start 0 and 2 as they lose to the Wide Loads 4 to 3 as they blew that lead. Blowfish wins 7 4. Nice win there. Buzzards beat the Nemesis 8 to 1. Okay. Platypie by win in 10, 6 to 4. Surlings bounce back to win game three. They're now two and one on the air as they beat the Blowfish ironically by the same score, two to one. And the Heaters will get their first win, 12 to nine, as they're off the Schneid. Damn Grass Eaters won again. They're three and zero. Oh, those bastards. <laughs> Beefles win again, one nil. Sandcats win 10-6. What else we got? Wildlands win in 10 over the Jacks. Jacks still winless at 0 and three. Freebitters need their first win, and they'll get it against the Moose 5-2. Okay, who will be taking on next episode? It is going to be the Moonstars. On the mound for us will be rookie Dom Turner. The 26-year-old will make his debut. And on the mound for the Moonstars is third-year veteran Yanagi Hayai. Or Hayai. I don't know how to pronounce that. But he still has K Neglector, so nice to see he hasn't improved too much. Player development, what do we got? Okay. I do like this one for Kabooster, but I can't afford it. This one for JYJ, I don't want to give him Wild Thrower. Dozen rolls, chance to lose utility, that's kind of dumb. BH4, this is the best one, but unfortunately can't afford it just yet. We have to wait one more game, hopefully it's still here. Trips doesn't really need the extra fielding, so I'm not going to go out here and shell out the money for it. So I think we'll wait on that. Alright, we'll set the lineup here and call it a day real quick. There are some magical names indeed. <laughs> All right, lineup we'll use for next episode. Leading off in left will be Call to Sack, making her first start of the year as she's going to play in left. Rookie Nicholson will go to DH rolls. We're going to put JYJ on the bench. Trips in center is locked in. He'll bat third. Fry is still catching. She'll bat fourth. Batting fifth, right fielder Johnny Bags. Batting sixth, shortstop John Ranero. Batting seventh is the tense Kira Nutmeg at third base. Might sub her out depending on how badly she does. Batting 8th, 1st baseman Peak Physique, and batting ninth will be Janice Friedman at 2nd. Alright, that is going to do it, guys. For this episode of the opening day series, we split it with the Sirloins, losing game 1, 8-1. to one. Then bounce back to win game 2, 10-9, despite trying to blow it multiple times. We decided not to, so we're 1-1 one and one in the series. Season here to start, looking for our 3rd straight championship ring. Next time out, we are taking on the division-leading Moonstars, who are 2-0. and oh, Can we get the job done? Tune in to find out. But if you made it this deep in the video, guys, thanks so much for sticking around. I appreciate the support, as always. If you haven't already, hit the follow and or subscribe buttons down below here on Twitch to be notified next time I go live. And if you haven't already over on YouTube, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. Link to Twitch down in the description below if you want to come over here, watch the games live before they're posted, and support me on this platform as well. I'll catch you on the next episode, everybody. Until then, this is The Nasty One. Signing off, and once again, thanks so much for Cheeseburger Jesus for the raid. I appreciate it, my friend. Thank you guys for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed what you saw. See you later, everybody. Have a wonderful evening.